With a wingspan of 105 feet and large enough to carry 30 people, the Hart X-1 is the largest electric aircraft produced to date. And it will also become the first one of its kind to take to the sky when it will fly on its first test run sometime in 2025. Hart Aerospace is a Swedish-based company that tries to bring electric power to the world of short-distance regional aircraft. When ready for operations, probably sometime in 2028, their plane will be called ES-30. Until then, the X-1 demonstrator must prove the plane is capable of doing what it was designed to do. We learned about the test aircraft being almost complete earlier in September 2024, but now Hart says it has chosen the location from where it will send the machine into the sky for the first time, the Plattsburgh International Airport in New York, a place that has all the required infrastructure and traffic levels to allow for the experimental flight. The first true outing of the plane in the medium where it's supposed to operate aims to validate the capabilities of the electric propulsion technology that goes into the plane. A tech that hasn't been fully detailed, but about which we know a thing or two. The undisclosed propulsion system of the demonstrator comprises four electric motors, each spinning a single propeller, of which there are two on each wing. The motors draw their power from a BAE system supplied battery, but also from a series of hybrid turbo generators. The setup is used for the first time into an electric conventional takeoff and landing regional aircraft, as per the company making it, and should allow the plane to cover a distance of up to 124 miles in all electric mode, and double that when the turbo generators kick in. In the production version of ES-30, the plane is not occupied to capacity, but by just 25 people, the range should increase to up to 500 miles. The tests that will be conducted on the X-1 are meant to inform the creation of a second aircraft, a pre-production prototype called Hart X-2. This one is scheduled to be ready in 2026, just two years before the planned rollout of the ES-30. Even if Hart Aerospace is not a household name in the aviation industry, and the solution it proposes not detailed in full, the electric aircraft idea caught the attention of the Federal Aviation Administration, which handed the company a $4.1 million grant but also airlines the likes of United Airlines, Air Canada, and JSX, which have already placed hundreds of orders for the upcoming ES-30. The X-1 demonstrator is not yet in the US, as it is still going through tests of critical systems at an undisclosed location. We'll probably hear about it once more when it makes the trip stateside.